Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Sarah and this is a coloring book review for Anamorphia by Kirby Rosanis. It is an extreme coloring and search challenge. And I have colored some in this book. So please excuse the pictures that are colored. Um, was trying out a few things on them. This book would be good for colored pencils, crayons, anything like that. The paper quality is a little bit thicker than copy paper, printer paper. Um, so it would be good for gel pens as well. I would not use markers of any kind on this book. The pages are just too thin. Um, the dimensions of the book are 10 by 10 inches. That's the front of the book. This is the back. This is the spine. And this is the thickness of the book. So let me do my flip through real quick. So you see it kind of um, bled through over here. Some of these were markers through this area, and that's why I said uh, markers are just not a good idea. Also, another thing in this book, um, the picture on this side will copy on this side if you're pressing down on here without a piece of paper between the two pages. So always keep paper between the pages. And at the back of the book, you'll find different creatures and items, artifacts um, that are hidden inside the book. And you can find those on any of the pages that you're looking at. And it has an answer key, of course, showing you where all the items are found and on what pages. Um, I use this as a test page since there isn't one in the book. And that is the end. Again, this is for Anamorphia.
Kirby Rosanis's um, an extreme coloring and search challenge. Thank you for watching, and as always, happy coloring.